Welcome everybody to another Monkey Man Strain Reviews, episode 10. First up on the strain review is Play-Doh. It's a 50-50 Indica Sativa. THC ranges between 21 and 23 percent. It's a cross of triangle mints with Pi 95. The buds have a thick sh spade-shaped frost green nugs with amber-tinted white crystal trichomes. The aroma is a nutty, doughy overtone scented by a bouquet of fresh, fruity berries, spicy cherries, and a touch of a woody diesel. It is great for anxiety, hypertension, and appetite loss. And she looking very pretty. For the looks, it's nice and covered in trichomes. It smells absolutely delicious. It's definitely got like a little, little nutty kind of Play-Doh kind of smell to it, but obviously with a skunky little finish. I'd say... For the looks department, about a 6 out of 10, maybe 6.5. As for the smell, let's break it open. Oh, yeah. Definitely got that berries with that spicy cherry kind of smell with a diesel finish. I'd say for the smell, we'll say a 7 out of 10. Let's grind it up. Berry and cherry smell just takes over. I'm excited to have a smoke of this. Cheers, y'all. <coughs> the taste is kind of what I expected, but different at the same time. <coughs> Ooh, very potent. <coughs> I say it's 50 50. I say it's more <coughs> like a 60 40. <coughs> so you can feel the indica on that one. Taste is the classic nutty <coughs> with a doughy pie crust flavor. With a very creamy vanilla <coughs> and a fruity cherries. That makes sense. You can really taste the fruity cherries. Damn. Definitely taste factor. <coughs> that was tasty. 8.5 out of 10. Damn. Now, all together, high taste, smell, looks, 
I'd say it's about, <coughs> especially the high, mm. do a 7.5 out of 10. Now before I do the next strain review, I hope you please like this video, share with your friends, subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. If you want to donate to this channel, 100% of the proceeds go directly right to this channel. The link is down below. And let's get back to the strain review. The next strain up goes by a weird name and I never heard of it before. It's called Tranquil Elephant Tizer. That's right, Tranquil Elephant Tizer. Its THC ranges from 20 to 22 percent. It is 70 percent indica. 30% sativa. It is a potent cross of the very powerful 88 G13 hash plant with snow lotus. The buds have PC round minty green nugs with thin orange hairs and dusty amber crystal tr trichomes. The aroma is very pungent and sour with spicy citrus and heavy dank earth. It's great for insomnia, chronic pain, cramps, chronic fatigue, and depression. On the looks department, it's covered in trichomes, coated in it. Lots of orange hairs, like it says. Um, I'd say about definite eight out of 10. As far as the smell goes, definitely checks every box of what I said, the aroma. Very, very dank. Very pungent, very earth, with that sour and spicy citrus. Oof. Based on the smell, definitely an 8.5 out of 10 for sure. Before I try this Tranquil Elephant Tizer, I haven't done a view shot in a minute. That's how I used to start my videos. She is gorgeous out. Bust open test. Oof. Very pungent and earthy, skunky. That's what it didn't mention. So I can't wait to try it. See if it has a different taste than what I mentioned. Cheers, monkey fam. Very potent. Wow. Tasty as hell. Wow, it has like this spicy herbal chemical flavor. With definite hints of sharp citrus. Oh yeah, I definitely had that huge sharp citrus on the exhale. With a heavy fuely diesel. Wow. As for the taste, 9.5 out of 10. I definitely enjoyed that one. Now, all together, the high. All together, we'll probably say this is a definite 9 out of 10. Highly recommended. Seems to be hard to find because I ain't never heard of it until now, but other people might have. Comment in the section if you have. And comment in the section on what strains you want me to try to review. But I hope you liked today's video. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Give that thumbs up. And I'll see you next time. If you like these videos, please subscribe. Weed.
spoil Edibles. There's nothing on the list that I won't review. Please like, subscribe, share, and comment for more. Thank you.